Tahoe and we're gonna do the Startbound competition. And this is our last chance to win. Hey girls, good morning. Brooke and Paige are doing a duet together this week. And I'm very excited about it. My girls have never danced together. I think it'll be nice. I'm doing a duet with my sister Brooke and the song's called Ooh La La and I really like it. Mia, Mackenzie, Chloe, Maddie, you could go through the group dance a little bit, but we're gonna rehearse it later. Brooke and Paige. I'm gonna send the girls into the other room. Abby sent my two daughters into another room with a guest choreographer, and Abby and Gianna stayed in the room and were teaching Maddie her solo. I was not very happy with that. I mean, why is there two teachers in there that know what my kids can do, both working with Maddie, but this is why Maddie wins and my kids don't? I had a rehearsal coach in there with them just to kind of guide them through some things. Paige and Brooke have never done a duet, so I wanted one of the other dance instructors to work with them on some double tricks and what they could do holding hands. All I wanted to do was give them something to do while I finished up with Maddie. Mine are gonna learn theirs in 15 minutes from a choreographer who doesn't even know what leg they kick on. Do you want me to say something to her? I mean, I don't- it, it, But the world you're gonna needs be a... to see why Maddie wins. Some children are difficult to work with, and some children are a joy to work with. My kids are in here with someone who they just met two, two weeks ago. That's the problem. Kelly totally flipped. She was out of line. She was rude and disrespectful, and I could hear every word she was saying. Kelly, do you really think that Maddie can't work with the choreographer she met two weeks ago? I think there's no reason for you to have two of you in there and mine in here with someone who doesn't even know what leg they kick on. No, he's supposed to be choreographing. Well, then let him count choreograph Maddie's. That sure as hell would never happen. All right, well, let's keep going on. We'll get 10th place. Maddie obviously will get first, and so will their duet. Yeah. Kelly? Come in here. What? I don't feel like fighting with her. But I have no problem. We would be more than happy to do her number, but you have to wait. One of you two should be helping him. You can surely teach Maddie yourself. But no, Maddie's the priority, so both of the main teachers work here. But Maddie, you can go and win, honey. Obviously, nothing was gonna change. Abby was still gonna finish with Maddie, and I was still gonna have the guest choreographer who was asking me what they could do. I'm not a teacher, I'm not a choreographer. I mean, I'm the dance mom. Jealousy. And it went right back to being jealous of the eight-year-old Maddie. Let's go, we're leaving. I'm done with it. I'm done. My kids, I don't care if they ever dance again. And Maddie can win again this week. And the world can think she's fabulous. Because my kids are gonna enjoy themselves at the pool. She leaves with her kids in an uproar, screaming and yelling, leaving the studio. So now, we're done. It's over. I don't have any more time to rehearse with them. And her kids are about to compete at nationals. So instead of getting my attention that she claims she wants, she got nobody's attention.